Next time you and your family are at the zoo, you will have some adorable little new animals to go see. Right now, the zoo has two four month old sloth bears, and they need your help picking a Philly style name for the cubs. I'm already on board with a couple of these names. But anyway, Chandler Lutz is live this morning, <laughs> soaking in all the cuteness. Are they hiding from you, Chandler? I heard the earlier in the break. Are they hiding, right? They're hiding right now. They're just down in their little moat area. But Natasha, they came out. We got to meet them. And these two boy sloth bear cubs are just the cutest. They made their debut yesterday. They were born back on January 2nd. They're twins. How amazing. I'm joined now by Maggie, the curator of carnivores. So, Maggie, let's talk about while we're trying to, we're going to hopefully see them soon. But let's talk about sloth bears. What are they? Tell me about the species. They are very cool species. What sets them apart from different bears is they actually um, have an adaptation that allows them to slurp up insects from uh, ground and termite mounds, okay. and it's really neat. And they're named sloth bears because they have these really massive claws that kind of resemble a sloth, um, and that actually helps them dig in the ground to get those bugs. But not related to sloths at all. They are definitely bears. Just resemble it. Just a, a little resemblance, bit. yes. Okay, and now this species is threatened, correct? How is the zoo helping in their survival plan? That is an excellent question. So yes, this species is threatened, and part of our mission here is to save endangered species and make sure that you know it doesn't elevate to an endangered status. So working with Safe Saving Animals from Extinction and Species Survival Plans, AZA institutions across the country set up breeding programs so that we can keep a population of these animals so that we can inspire people to save them in the wild. And so I'm, sh I'm sure you're so happy you had two male twins, right? Yes, the Species Survival Plan and um, you know, People that are ready to breathe sloth bears all over the country are very excited for when they finally, one day they will leave us and we have like a little match.com kind of set up <laughs> for them and they'll find new girlfriends and, you know, we'll just be increasing the population in AZA zoos and aquariums everywhere. That's amazing. And so now the public gets a gets to play a part in naming these two cuties, right? Yes, we are very excited. So, you know, we're America's first zoo and Philadelphia is, you know, our heart. So we've got two two groups of names for Philadelphia legends. We've got Kelsey and Harper, obviously cool. Philly sports teams. Yep. And Hollow Notes, a legendary Philadelphia band. And how can people vote for the names? You can go to our website, PhiladelphiaZoo.org, where you can watch our bear come CAM sponsored by Xfinity, or you can go to CBS's website. Perfect. Yes, we have a link on our website there, and I think they are still hanging out in their moat. We are not getting to nap time, <laughs> okay. um, so you have been an integral piece <laughs> of training them to be on exhibit with us and getting them used to all the, you know, razzle dazzle. Perfect. But just like normal toddlers, they do like to take their naps. They do, and we were taking pictures of them. We were getting them ready, and lastly, it was, you know, Memorial Day is just around the corner. When is the best time? It's not nap time to come to come see the Cubs. Afternoons. So we're working with them in a schedule, and so afternoons will be majority of the time that we put them out. Amazing. And you'll see them bouncing around the exhibit looking for all the snacks we hide. Awesome. Thank you so much, You're Maggie. very welcome. Well, unfortunately, we didn't get to see them right now, but as I was posting on social media the pictures and we were posting videos, they are just the cutest. I definitely have my favorites and names, but you can go to our website for a link and you can name them yourself. <laughs> They are so cute, I bet. I mean, I'm just assuming nap time is important. I mean, we don't want to dis disrupt their nap time, no. Chandler. Mm -hmm. so. Everybody needs a nap time, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't, don't we all? <laughs> we know that very well. Can't wake a sleeping bear cub. Exactly. So, okay, we'll get back to you. Maybe they'll be awake by the time we get back to you, okay? Thank you, Chandler. <laughs>